did in the building. And then today I'm going to show you if your computer screen looking like this or jacked up like this, you can always still use these computers. By, or if you got a good computer without the screen crack, it doesn't matter. But what I'm saying, you can hook both. You can hook this computer up to your TV and share your screen twice. See what I'm saying? All you need is a cord like this, an HDMI cord. HDMI, not the USB. And what you're going to do is you're going to hook it up, see on the side of your computer, look on the side. See that funny looking cord uh, thing right there? That plug right there is funny looking. That's the HDMI. And what you do is you're going to put this inside this port right here. See, don't hook it the HDMI cord, not a USB. If you only have USB, they do have adapters for that. And what you're going to do is you're going to hook that into your computer. You're going to take the other end of the cord and hook it into your TV. Now, if you got a TV like this or this or this, it's not going to work. You need a regular TV or an up-to-date TV. You hook this in the back of your TV. And what you're going to do is once you hook it in the back of your TV, you're going to Go in your menu and select HDMI, which is port 1, 2, or 3, which is one you hook it up to. And once you hook your TV to your computer, if your computer's still good, you can share your screen. See, that's, this is my Windows right here, and this is my second screen. So what I can do is take something from this side right here, and I can drag it. See, drag it over to here. Now I have a Windows right here. And the windows right here. You can do this as many times as you need to. See? You can take a window from here. And you can take it and you can drag it here. See? From here to here. Here to here. Easy peasy lemon squeeze. All you need is one HDMI cord and an up-to-date TV. This is my studio, y'all, while we at it. See? Book of Time don't play. We get out around here. Some of this stuff I found in the garbage can, I just brought it back. But you're going to get that HDMI cord, you're going to stick it into the side of that laptop. You're going to take the other end and stick it into the back of your TV, your up-to-date TV. Like I said, I can't stress strong enough, up-to-date. You're going to go on your menu and you're going to look for your HDMI settings. That's what you need. Once you get your HDMI settings, you're going to click on it. And then, like I said, if you got Windows or whatever, you can take one window from here. And you can drag it to here. And you can look at videos over here. 